I'm Phyllis Lang and welcome to Nightwear. This video introduces SQM Reader Pro software, a product that allows you to read, display, and manage darkness data acquired from Unihedron's Sky Quality Meter Model LE. In this video, I'll show the general layout of the product. In later videos, I'll go into further detail about various features. Generally, the upper portion of the main window display contains the control pages. These direct SQM Reader Pro reading, graphing, display, and storage capabilities. The middle panel contains the commands to initiate reading and stop reading. And the lower panel contains the display pages. This page displays the most recent reading as text. It also displays statistics accumulated within the most recent collection period. The graph page gives you a visual display of readings over time. You can configure this graph as I'll show you in a moment. The final page in the display area is the log page. It will show you text messages if any warnings occur during the data collection period. It's empty at the moment good. So moving back to the top control pages, the first page is the meter page where you configure the address of the meter, you test the connection with the meter, and you describe the geographic placement of the meter. The next page is the data collection page where you determine whether you want to read the meter once or in continuous automated fashion. In continuous reading, you can specify how often the meter is read and whether the meter is read during daylight hours. The graphing page allows you to configure the, the displayed graph at the bottom of the program window. There are several metrics you might elect to graph, and you can configure the density of data on the page. Next, the data storage page allows you to determine which of the three files will be saved to disk as the readings occur. One file type is a simple comma separated value format file that contains your readings. The second possibility is the textual display area uh, snapshotted to a JPEG file. And the final type of file would be a snapshot of your graph page stored as JPEG. The file configuration control page is the send data page. You can send any of the three files that you may have specified in the data storage page to either a processing program, script, or batch file, and you can send any of the three files collected to FTP server remote you can specify the host of your server and the account information and in fact test the connection. That's it for the introduction for SQM Reader Pro. I hope you continue watching the further tutorials in this series.